Good morning to you, the cyclists of Wales. I'm Adam Holt, and welcome to the Race Report Show here on WCTV. I'm here at Ramp World Cardiff today for the Backyard Jam, the Freestyle BMX National Series. This is the weekend of BMX here on WCTV with the Backyard Jam taking place on the Saturday and the Clumsy BMX South and Southwest Regional Race Series in the Clumsy Valley on the Sunday. So make sure to stick around to see all of the action there. But first, the Backyard Jam saw some incredible up and coming talent take to the ramps to showcase their skills in this British Cycling National Series event. And what a great event to be held in the capital with some of Welsh youth competitors taking claim to the top steps of the podium. It really shows the growth of this incredible sport here in Wales and some real promise for the future. Here we have Ella and Fionn competing in the under 15 girls category and taking first and second on the day after some packed runs. We did capture a great interview with both of these girls but unfortunately we had a connection issue with a mic all weekend and despite a lot of work to try and fix these issues this week I haven't been able to salvage any of the interviews which is absolutely gutting because I do believe I recorded the best interview I've ever done with Oliver the winner of the under 9's boys competition so Oliver if you're watching I'll definitely be looking for you for another interview next time but despite not having any interviews we still got some amazing footage of some big tricks to finish off a day here with the elite category On the Sunday we swapped the ramps for the track but stayed on the 20 inch wheels as we headed to Clumby Valley for the much anticipated Welsh round of the South and South West Regional BMX Racing Series. We were hoping to see a second round of the series at the new world class track built in Cardiff this year too but the track isn't quite ready so we look forward to covering some awesome regional racing next year. So for the only South and South West regional in Wales this year, it was a scorcher with the sun beaming down into the valley as the riders took to the gates. Look out for the grey and yellow jerseys of Columbia Valley and the white and blue jerseys of Cardiff BMX Club as they fly the flag for Wales. Both Clumsy and Cardiff had some great results throughout the categories and as always it was epic to see such young riders flying down the start hill and taking on the rollers in a fight for the first bend. Saw some brilliant skillful riding, close battles and also some incredible races where the winners made up a huge amount of ground on the rest of the field. We did manage to salvage one interview over the weekend from a Welsh BMX racing legend who took some time to chat with me about the BMX culture here in Wales. I'm here with... Sim Johnston from Cardiff BMX Club. Awesome, and what's your background? So, I've been involved with BMX for years, probably too long to remember, as a kid and then took time away from BMX and got back into it about seven years ago. Got pulled back into regionals, then nationals, doing the Worlds. We're doing Glasgow this year. But I've been, in, been away from any BMX track this year. This is the first race back. So to be in sunny Wales at Lumvi, great track, you know, great crowd. It's been really good, really good day. And what, what brought you back into BMX? I think it's that thing, you know, the whole middle age thing and missing bikes and wanting to get back into it. But you realise once you are back in, it's such a community sport. And the lovely thing is seeing the kids coming back in and the progression. But on the flip side now, I think one of the busiest categories is probably the 50, 50 plus, 55 plus cruisers. So it's all those that used to race are sort of getting back into it, I think, because everyone just loves the buzz of being on a bike. And it seems like BMX racing is growing a bit at the moment as well. Yeah, well why, why do you think it is? 
I've had some time away, um, but certainly for South Wales especially, um, obviously we've got this facility here in Thlumvi, we've got Bristol up the road, there's Burnham, there's, there's loads of tracks, but I'm involved with Cardiff BMX, and um, you've probably seen on social media the great work that's going on there, and fingers crossed we're going to have a rideable track in you know, a month or so time, and that's going to be a game changer. It will be, yeah, because obviously at BMX, uh, Cardiff BMX, haven't got a facility at the moment, so it's probably one of the only BMX clubs in the UK without a facility. Yeah, I think it's been done the right way, though, as in the interest is there. We've got the people first, if you like, to build a community, and the tracks come in. And it, it's going to be the only outdoor eight-metre start here in the UK. A brilliant training facility, um, one that I desperately need to get ready for the world, because I say I've been without a bike. But we can see already... You know, people of all ages are desperate to get on there. Um, all different levels. There's going to be loads of coaching sessions. Loads of people wanting to get involved. So, really looking forward to it. Awesome. And uh, you said you're riding the wheels later in the year. Yeah, yeah. So, Glasgow. Um, I did the national there a few years back when the track was really deep and horrible. I'm told they've mellowed it out, so it should be a bit more forgiving. But, um, yeah, some big training ready for that. I think it's um, August, early August is, is that. So, looking forward to it. Good luck with that. Thanks a lot, mate. Cheers. Take care. Cheers. Cheers. Another excellent event run by a Welsh club. And if you would like to get involved with the Clinvy Valley BMX Club, they train on Tuesdays, Thursdays and Sundays at the Clinvy BMX track. See their Facebook page for more information on weekly what's on at the track posts. I plan to take my family up next Sunday to give it a go. So I'll see you there. But before we go, this weekend sees Marsh Tracks and VC Melid host the Welsh Circuit Race Championships. I won't be there myself, but we do have a special guest reporter covering all the action. I think we're in for quite a treat and a slightly different perspective from the race. Make sure to tune in on our social stories for some epic coverage as we crown some Welsh champions and find out who our special guest reporter will be. For now though, I'm Adam Holt and this was The Race Report.